Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm going to discuss and actually show you some of my tricks and tips that I actually tried for myself. How you can actually fix such problem I will be showing you on my Samsung phone but it's actually pretty similar and I would say uh, almost the same for any Android phone. How you can fix such problem as crashing apps and maybe freezing apps. Uh, or maybe when your app's just shutting down. So now I'm going to show you exactly how you can fix it. But before starting watching this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe with notifications to never miss out my new video. So let's go. So now I'll be going to show you on my actually Duolingo application. It can be any game or any other application that you actually choose or you have problem with. So now we're going right into my settings and your settings so we can actually fix this so go into our application section and here you can just simply find your application that you have problems with so now i really suggest you to first of all uh, to actually take focus on our storage so uh, especially when your application or game has access to internet it will probably have some amount of actually cache memory in your uh, application storage so i really suggest you to first of all try to clear your cache after this just try to relaunch your application and see if if there's uh, i don't know if there are some changes if there is not so i really highly recommend you to uh, try to reboot your phone and after this maybe your actually problem will be fixed so how does this actually method work so we i think that we usually just um i would say blame any developers or any applications that we actually download but i would say that some major of the times uh, the applications are not actually i would say uh victims of the situation so sometimes our phone might be also uh, freezing etc just crashing some data lost and after this uh, any applications might not be working so i really suggest you to reboot your phone and just um, look if there is some change happen so if even this method didn't work i really suggest you to go into our battery section so i think that this section really plays so as i said this section plays really important role in overall regularity of our actually app uh, i would say system so if we go into this section optimize better usage so this is basically our i would say safe pillow of any actually android phone and maybe even ios so this actually optimize better usage setting is actually i would say constricting and somehow depriving our apps from i would say infinite system i would say working so as you can see we can go into all apps and find our application that we are interest, interested in so now i'm going to find and as you can see this application is actually optimized so what does this mean optimized apps will see it will use less battery but some background functions will be restricted so as you can see this setting is basically restricting any application that might take some i would say a little bit more than limited by this setting power and your app just by this setting may crash and just closed up so now i really highly suggest you to turn off some optimization from apps that you actually need and that you are experiencing some i would say kind of uh, problems so you just have to press here and wait a little, a little bit until your actually application will be not optimized so as you can see yeah my application is not optimized anymore and after this i really uh, actually convinced that after this setting actually your applications will work much much better so if you enjoyed watching this video please don't forget to like and subscribe with notifications see you later